Okay, I am super pumped to talk to you guys about this one tool that is going to change your lives, I think, forever. If you're not using it, you need to start using it today. My inner nerd is coming out and I don't even care. Melissa K. Lowe, and I am the time management coach to the Wealthy Mama community. I'm so glad you're here. Today, I am super excited to talk to you about 12 ways ChatGPT can specifically help you as a working mom. But first off, let's talk quickly about what ChatGPT is. ChatGPT is an artificial intelligence tool created by OpenAI. Artificial intelligence means that as it's receiving information, it's actually learning and storing that information in its memory so that it can give you more knowledgeable answers over time. If you only remember one thing from this video with regards to ChatGPT, I want it to be this. Always fact check the information that you get from ChatGPT from trusted and verified sources. It doesn't always get the information right. So please do not take it as gospel. The version we're gonna talk about today is the free version and that's version 3.5. There is a version four, but that costs $20 a month. We're not talking about that today. Signing up is super easy. All you need to do is to go to openai.com, click on sign up in the top right hand corner and put in your information. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. I don't know about you, but we love a birthday party at our house. What would have taken me days is now only taking me hours with ChatGPT. Everything you need from what location your party should be to what size cake you need can be answered in a few seconds. Here's an example to give you an idea of what ChatGPT can do. So we're gonna go over to one of the tabs and select new chat. Here, we're gonna type in the following prompt. I only have two hours for my daughter's unicorn birthday party. Could you help me come up with a timeline for her event that would include cake cutting, photo booth, pinata, and arts and crafts? I definitely wanna cut the cake last, but I'm open to ideas for everything else so that the kids have fun and don't get bored. Just like that, we have a timeline that's either ready for use or a good starting point. Now, birthdays are a one and done kind of event, but what about things that are actually recurring? One daily struggle and annoyance for moms is figuring out what everybody's gonna eat today. I don't think I've ever had a client or a friend for that matter who has mastered the art of meal planning. Enter ChatGPT. Of course it can do the basics like offering up meal ideas and recipe suggestions, but I want you to think bigger. I could tell you, but I think it's better if I show you. Let's head back into ChatGPT. Could you provide a recipe for a light and fluffy chocolate cake? And within seconds, a recipe appears. But what if I ran out of baking soda? Well, let's ask. I don't have any baking soda. Can you give me a suitable substitute? Not only does it tell you that baking powder can be used, it rewrites the recipe with the right conversion. So no more calculators for you. I'm a math girl and even I'm excited about this. Okay, I just gotta show you one more thing. If I'm gonna make spaghetti and meatballs with the chocolate cake, can you create a grocery list in table format that is organized by category? Voila, if your mind is not blown, I don't think we can be friends anymore. Are the possibilities of ChatGPT coming into focus for you? Oh, it makes me so excited. So we talked a little bit about ChatGPT at home. Let's bring it into the office. As good as I am at my job, I absolutely loathe updating my resume. And if my boss is watching, I love my job. Trying to summarize years of hard work into one sentence line items is truly a skill that not a lot of us have. Now, you don't have to. All you have to do is describe in detail to ChatGPT what it is that you do and ask it to summarize it into short, impactful statements. What if grammar is your issue? You can copy your resume into ChatGPT and have it proofread it for you. You can also copy a job description that you're targeting and ask ChatGPT to help you tailor your resume so it speaks specifically to that job, making it more relevant and appealing to recruiters. Here's a prompt for you. I'm applying for a marketing manager position in a technology company. I've worked in marketing for over five years, but never in management before. The job description mentions the need for skills in digital marketing, campaign management, and data analytics. 
How can I tailor my resume to highlight these skills and increase my chances of landing the job? How much time would this have saved you back in the day? Maybe when it comes time for you to look for a position, you can apply to many more jobs, increasing your chance of finding something that you actually love to do. Okay, we're gonna stay at work for a little while and talk about something that a lot of women have problems with, and that is negotiation. Come promotion time, maybe you get a bit tongue-tied, you don't know what information is gonna be the most useful to get you to that next level. Well, what if there was a way for you to prepare yourself mentally and strategically for that dreaded salary conversation? Let me show you what I mean. I was offered a starting salary of $50,000 for a senior accounting position at my company. I would like to counter with $70,000. Can you help me write a pitch for the negotiations and tell me what information should be included. Even if your pitch will be in person, ChatGPT can help you identify what factors are necessary to help you make a compelling case. To be honest, sometimes we think we're ready for a conversation about moving to the next level. You can really determine your readiness to go to that next level. It won't just be based on emotion, which will only help your confidence and allow you to sell it when you are ready for those conversations. Let's head back to the home and let me make myself abundantly clear. I am not telling you to log on to ChatGPT when it's time for homework and plop it in front of your second grader and say, here you go, off to the races. This tool is for you. Considering that this is all very new, I think it's best as parents that we try out these new technologies before we expose our children to them. Maybe you need three different ways to describe fractions because you don't know which one is gonna stick with your daughter. Or you're like me, where history is not your strong suit, but your son has a project about the fall of the Roman Empire. Let's go into ChatGPT and look at the prompt for explaining fractions. I have a second grader. Help me explain fractions in three different ways. How much time would it have taken you to figure that out? More than seconds. The answer is more than seconds. Ain't nobody got time to be looking through random websites on a Tuesday just to figure this out ourselves. We have already taken the classes. We have passed go. We have collected $200. We don't have anything to prove. This is the time to use the tools that are afforded to us. There's nothing wrong with fast tracking your skills so that you can be a support to your child. Don't let anybody make you feel guilty or that you're cheating because you're not. Let's save our time for the things that actually matter. If you are loving these tips so far, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, hit that notification bell, and subscribe to the channel. This one is for all my mamas who wanna get more fit but don't really know what to do, when to do it. Maybe you don't like going to the gym or maybe you're tired of scrolling through YouTube trying to find another video that you like and it just takes so much time. Then you should give ChatGPT a try. You can give it context about your statistics, your goals, even your dislikes and ask it to develop a workout tailored just for you. What would it mean to you to have a routine that you look forward to doing that helps support your health and your energy. So let's take a look at what this looks like as a prompt. We just got a new stationary exercise bike and I am definitely beginner level. Can you create a three month plan to take me from beginner to intermediate while training 30 minutes a day, three days a week? Isn't that incredible? Each week, it has given me a little bit more of a challenge that in theory seems attainable. Like I said, the possibilities are endless. How can you use this to get more active, stay healthier, and love moving your body again? I love a family vacation just as much as the next person, but there's one thing I could do without, and that is figuring out what everyone's gonna wear while we're on our trip that can account for every scenario that could happen in the entire universe. Maybe we'll go on a three-day hike. Maybe we'll end up in an Oscar party. It can all feel like a bit much, deciding what to wear not only for yourself, but for all the members of your family. Not when you have ChatGPT. Imagine you could simply type in where you're going, when you're going, who you're going with, and ask it to create a packing list for you. Step into 2023 with me where this is now a reality. Help me pack for a two week trip to New York City for my family of four. Ages 41, dad, 40, mom, 10, son, daughter, seven. We are going in August and we'll have access to a washer and dryer. 
We plan to do some sightseeing, go to a Broadway show, have a few nice dinners, and find a water park. Can you create a minimalist packing list for each person? Like, are you seeing what I'm seeing? How much time have you spent thinking about what type of clothes should we wear? How many should we bring? Now you have a companion to help you figure these things out. It won't always get it right, but it's gonna get you darn close. Maybe go one step further, print these off and turn these into a little checklist and help fast track the packing process for everyone. I know summer is right around the corner. And while I want my kids to have fun, I don't necessarily wanna be responsible for identifying what fun looks like every single day. If you're not putting your kids in summer camp, three months of activities can feel like a very daunting task. But fear not, our friend ChatGPT has got you covered. Create a list of summer activities for my six and eight year old to help them get ready for the school year, but also give them something fun to do. My six year old loves art and is very hands-on while my eight-year-old loves sports and science. In no time, ChatGPT gives you a list of ideas that may work for each child and even a few they can do together. And just like that, you are now not dreading summer, you're actually looking forward to it. So now let's head back to work. Maybe you're interested in up-leveling your skills because you wanna to go to that next level in your career. It can act as your mini project manager by drafting a specific action plan to help you acquire those skills. Let's go into ChatGPT and prompt it with the following. I want to learn Microsoft Excel. I have zero experience and don't know where to start. Can you create a 30-day action plan to help boost my Excel skills and provide resources that can help me along the way? Here is a detailed plan to help you get to that next level. Take this a step further and take the information from this action plan and put it on your calendar to create accountability for yourself. You're gonna be unstoppable. Parenting does not come with a manual, but I think we should start a petition where we at least get a pamphlet. When challenges arise, it's important that we have a resource that can point us in the direction of articles, books, or support groups about specific topics. But going one step further and offering us suggestions or potential solutions is a game changer. Let's say, for example, you're having trouble putting your three-year-old to bed. Then maybe this prompt will work for you. I'm struggling to establish a bedtime routine for my toddler. Any advice on how to make bedtime smoother? Look at the list of options available. For a parent who feels like they've tried everything, having new things to try is synonymous with hope. And sometimes that's all we need to keep us motivated and energized. I would argue that that's better than a manual. Now I know you might be thinking, how in the heck is ChatGPT going to help me with my wardrobe? It can give you suggestions on patterns, textures, and silhouettes that align with your style goals, helping you curate a wardrobe that feels good and feels just like you. You can describe the type of item that you're looking for, and ChatGPT can suggest brands, stores, and other resources within your budget. Let's take it for a spin. I'm looking to add a few key pieces to my capsule wardrobe. Can you recommend stores or brands that offer high quality, versatile items that are under $100? My style is bohemian, similar to that of free people. And just like that, a list of stores you can start with to build out your capsule wardrobe affordably and within your style is generated. If you need more suggestions, just ask ChatGPT for 10 or even 20 more recommendations and it will oblige without you having to set the stage or provide context again. Now, don't go spending all your money. And remember, this is supposed to help you save time, but if it can help you save money too, let's also use that function, shall we? Now, this one is a bit controversial, but I also wanna recognize that not everyone has the same kind of support systems. It can challenge preconceived notions and help us consider alternative perspectives that we may have never thought of ourselves. Now consider you and your friend have different parenting styles and it's been causing tension. You are more of a strict, traditional parent and she is more of a gentle parent. How can ChatGPT help you respect an approach that's different from your own? Here's the prompt. I have different parenting beliefs than my close friend and it's causing tension in our relationship. 
I believe in providing more structure and discipline with my children, and she believes in gentle parenting at all costs. Can you help me gain a different perspective around gentle parenting? You can, in the privacy of your own home, educate yourself on the benefits and see the other side of things without ego or pride getting in the way. You've got a whole list of reasons to respect your friend's choice. It's a proactive step from us being one question away from being able to meet each other in the middle. Now I'm gonna teach you a bonus tip to get the kind of responses that you need from ChatGPT even if you have no experience writing a prompt. We think of ChatGPT as a responder, but one of its most powerful features is its ability to ask questions. Here's an example. I want to improve my communication skills at work, especially in difficult conversations. Can you ask me questions to identify areas for growth and provide advice on effective communication strategies? ChatGPT is using a holistic approach to ensure that you are providing enough context so it can get you the best result. How cool is that? Don't be afraid to have a conversation. You're not only prompting it and giving it commands, allow it to ask you questions you didn't even know you needed the answers to. Now you know the secret sauce to getting top-notch answers every single time. I hope that I've been able to convince you that ChatGPT can make your life easier and that you need to start using it today. I promise you this video is not sponsored. I am just super excited about all the possibilities that this tool can provide us, especially when it comes to saving time so we have the time for the things that truly matter. Let me know in the comments which one of the 12 ways you're most excited about and if you've been using ChatGPT in other ways that I didn't mention today. Let's share and educate each other and get smarter together as a community. As always, thanks for watching. See you next time.